How you doing, brother? So I'm Robert Laird, the CEO of Dio Azul Tequila. Nice to meet you finally. Nice to meet you finally. Glad you're putting this together. You're putting some work in today. Absolutely, absolutely. This is, this is like number 12 in a row. I'm very yeah. impressed to see. Yeah, it's, uh, <laughs> they, uh, you know there's a piece of you in the back of your head that's like, these fools better show up. <laughs> <laughs> they all showed up. And they all came. Yeah, I, could, right. I honestly couldn't be more happy, man. No, we, um, I'm, wa I'm, I'm watching it unfold between our, you know, right before our eyes, and I know you are too, because you, you know this is all new. This is where, you know, barely power slap 10. It's really taken the notoriety over the last 12 months, you know, really. And so these emerging, you know, downlines, which are, you know, content creators like this, are really bringing the whole thing to life. And I think that's what I love most is that Dana has created this ecosystem of brand new content creators and real life people. That's why I freaking love it. Yeah, it's amazing, man. It's been fun to, um, uh, my son and I went to PS8, so the last one that was in Vegas. Okay. And I'm an MMA nerd, have been yeah. since uh, uh, Ortiz Liddell are we all? three. Are we not? I mean, are, I mean, come on. I mean, come on. Let's, right. let's be honest. I know. Me and Liddell um, are yeah, still high fives up. Yeah, I we're in America, right? We we don't even talk about soccer. <laughs> um, so, but we went, and it was crazy. It was crazy. And just to validate what you're saying, he joked. He joked. He's like, I want to start a podcast. I'm like, okay, cool. I'll you know, I'll reach out. I'm not shy. Yeah. And thinking we'll get a couple. But the next thing you know. And it's been fun to say this a lot today because I really, I really do believe it. And we're going to talk about your story with this because that's sure. what's important. But it was, we talk about slapping, but the next thing you know, we're talking. Yeah. And it's like, people need to know, yeah. they yeah. need to know that like, this is actually changing lives. Yeah. You might think it's stupid, but this no. is what I say. No. I don't drink Coca-Cola. I yeah. just don't, I don't like it. Yeah. They don't give a shit. Yeah. They're doing fine. Yeah. They're fine. And yeah, no. so it's important for no, us to get this, this, these and stories I, out. I, I couldn't agree with you more. And I think what I love is the parallel between our brand merging right around the same time as Power Slap, which has made it such a cohesive, awesome experience for us, my team, okay, which is the same type of performers that are you know coming on here as strikers. These are regular guys that are getting an opportunity Absolutely. to create, you know, uh, imagery and create their own kind of um, future in the sport that's emerging. So I like that we're able to get some publicity with real people. And I think more than ever, like the audience out there, which is, is proven by the viewership, wants it. Yeah. They I, just want real. They just Does want that make real. Because like, they just want fucking real. That's the stickiness. Totally. Like everybody loves, you know, a comedy. Everybody loves a drama. Everybody yeah. loves whatever. But it's the one that you go, oh, I felt something. Yeah, exactly. You know what yeah. I mean? And that's yeah. what's going on with yeah. it. So imagine having a product or whatever it is that a celebrity, you know, you know, these celebrities jump into these things without doing a ton of research on really, you know, where it's from, quality, everything else, and then they just, you know, are able to say whatever they want because they've built this platform we've given them. And this is different. What I've noticed is our brand, particularly, which is phenomenal. It's the best tequila I've ever had in my life. And we're telling a story in a really authentic way, right, with really authentic partnerships. And so I think that's kind of our key to success so far we've seen in such a short amount of time. Yeah, I was gonna ask you, it has been like no time. And I'm seeing <laughs> you guys have distribution. Sure. You're leveraging it already. Yeah. Like, so is it just in California right now? But it feels like it's <clears throat> going national. It's a great question. So we wanted to, to I'm out of Northern California. Okay, I'm born and raised NorCal. There. Yep, NorCal, boom. And you know, my kiddos are up there, my sons, of course. So that's, that's uh, home base. But we wanted to give this brand, as I as I discovered it and got to know the family, and we could put we got into business together. We wanted to give it a hospitality hotspot that really would um, do justice to the quality of the product. So we went into San, San Diego, yeah. And San Diego has been an absolute phenomenal uh, partner for us. That's okay. awesome. I know. Yeah, we're partnered with MLS down there. We're partnered. Um, SDFC. I saw you. I was going to say yeah. the the football club. Yep, the yeah. new football club that launches in March. SDFC. I mean, their entire team has been phenomenal, and so we're their title sponsor for Snapdragon Arena and everything else. But more importantly, it's like the on-premise restaurant hospitality right, right experience. The circle keep correct, coming through. Which I've I've been in my whole life in sales and career, and so we're kind of trying. We're bringing hospitality back to hospitality in the spirit world, which it's really lacking right now. Right, okay? right. With a lot of contracting on some of these bigger companies. So there's an area of, area of opportunity. And, and luckily I've built a team where the team has just been, I'm so proud of, by the way, it's a, it's a pedigree. Um, and everyone has gotten behind really the story of the Partidas who produce it with me. And then of course, what we're trying to do in the market by sharing the story, sharing a really great experience uh, and doing it for a pretty affordable price. Uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So we're in California, Nevada, Arizona, Florida, and then we'll have 
you know, we're working our way down. And is it, you test the market, right? Like it's beta testing. Per precisely, yeah. Piloted in San Diego. You know, we saw some successes with some of our predecessors, like a Tito's, right? Took yeah, over sure. Austin, Texas yeah. in a really authentic way. Nobody thought they could, anybody could rival a kettle or a goose or whatever. And guess what? Do you order anything else? I don't. Right. I ordered Tito's because they earned it. They earned it in an authentic way. So <clears throat> even though we're not celebrities, by any means we're coming with really you know with a big heart and good vibes and good intentions and we're sharing the story of a product that frankly deserves everybody's interest yeah it's um people see what can be done with celebrity mm -hmm. they see um um oh shit, i forgot her name they did alani new but oh, they, 18, they, 18, 18, 18 or yeah yeah, yeah, yeah or yeah. like but even like uh the Eva biggest Longoria. the biggest in your face example right they yeah. see logan paul at ksi yeah. with prime yes, and they yes, think yes. boom it's that yes, easy yes and but that doesn't necessarily they will be fine but that doesn't yeah. necessarily last look here's what we're noticing flat out and we can talk about it on this this is a really good platform <clears throat> because as i was a te you know tequila connoisseur i thought and it's like hey am i gonna get casamigos right for 17 bucks for a shot or 16 or am i gonna get class days for 44 depending on where i'm at what i want to spend you know those are not what authentic hispanic partnerships drink they don't they don't fly out they, la they laugh at us about it so when you look at some of these celebrities that have launched brands like marky mark who i love dearly and kevin hart who i love dearly <laughs> and the rock who i love dearly and they're all ranked like the bottom third of every distillery produced because at the end of the day they they, the concert <laughs> knows they did zero work like it makes no sense we're ranked top 25 so we're, we're a top 20 distillery out of 153. And frankly, every single one of those big boys, okay, that's your Don Julio's, wants the Partita's way of producing tequila. <laughs> so here we are. That's very validating. It's a validating experience for them. And, and we're their first partner here, really this side of the border, that's really highlighting what they've done for four generations, which is an incredible production in an artisan approach of a, a spirit that honestly will change the way you enjoy tequila. I promise you, like, it's just the way it is. <laughs> Dude, I love it. Let's talk about, um, and just to validate that, long term, that's what works. Yeah. That's what works. Yeah. So, yeah, so just to validate that. But I am really interested on how it came to be <clears throat> involved with Slap, because as a fan, this is what I see, right? I see Dana's I whiskey. Do it, do it, do it, do it. I'll join you real quick. Hey, should we cheers it up? Fuck yeah, we What's should. What's up, baby? Yeah, yeah. So I see Dana's uh, whiskey. I see Monster Energy Drink. Yeah, Holler has. So great. how does yeah. that work? Where you just are you pushing all like all those no, out? No, no, absolutely you, not. No, okay. Here's, here's so how do, how does that come to be? How does that work? It's a great question. This is a good topic. So what we love most about selecting this partnership with Dana and and actually being given being gifted the opportunity, right? Sure. At such a young startup age for a thing, is the fact that they love um, authentic partners that are loyal, right, to the kind of who they yeah. are, right, the way yeah. they do business. And I mean, like, we've been fans of Dana forever. I mean, I, I, he spent an hour and a half with us day one as if we were talking Which like that shows you that they were in. Right. Now, it helped that he tasted the Aneo and he was like, holy shit, that's the best thing I've ever had hurt. in my life. <laughs> so that didn't hurt. But it goes further than that because we're, 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 I'm friends, very good friends with his partners at Howlerhead. By sheer oh, really? coincidence, three years ago when I met Dana, it was at the Nate Diaz fight Okay, in, in Glendale in Arizona. Yeah. And I was gifted kind of seats with the owner, his partners at Howlerhead, which is a phenomenal, you know, flavored whiskey. I mean, yeah. if you haven't had They're it, doing I, good. I'm, I don't even like banana and I love that shit. It's fucking great. So <laughs> what I love with Dana is he knows now what uh, a spirit collaboration can do. And they've got a nice little, you know, it's done well. It's had you know, like a really good trajectory. Yeah. So I know there's... He's looking at this like, okay, let's let's see what these guys do, and obviously we'll, we love the sponsorship, and that you know how that goes, a two-way street, right? They, you right. know, for sponsorships, deliverables are important, but I think fundamentally he's he, he knows it's a good product. I know he's impressed with the team, and I know he's uh, rooting for us, and that's all we. Does getting a, even though we know Slap's numbers are people don't want to admit it, no. but they're amazing. It's it, it and yeah, and I'll, I'll, here's how this preface: we 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 got into the partnership with Thrill One Entertainment first really correct 
And so we locked in Nitro Cross, Nitro Circus. 100%. Which, yeah, yeah. You know, SLS. If, everybody, if not everybody knows that, get your ass to a Nitro Circus, get your ass to SLS because it is a hell of a time. Uh, so we're title sponsors of that, and that's how we warmed up this relationship. And we got into kind of a celebratory meeting because we had already closed the deal and already sent some cash, and everyone's happy. <laughs> right, right, right. Right. The wire went through. Yeah, the wire went through. <laughs> yeah, we bought his bought his friendship. Okay. Now he loves hey, it. Hey, everyone but has to. You have to. It's all good. Pay to play. So, um, and by the time he tasted it, he was done. He goes, and they go, we want to show you power slot because we have a space available for tequila. Oh no shit! And I go, are you fucking serious? And I'm looking at the numbers, and I go, this is more than NCAA and NFL and NHL and MLB combined and it's fucking in its infancy. So as a strategic marketer and the owner of a brand that's emerging, I was like, oh my God, like, okay, let's make yeah. it work. And the bargain, um, it's a bargain. Yeah. Is and it a multiple year deal or is it like we're lo- we every locked, 12? I'm so thrilled we're locked in for three years. Oh shit. Yep. So, uh, with extensions, I, I don't plan on going anywhere. So. Sure. Um, you know, it's right of refusal, first right of refusal, all that Absolutely. stuff. Absolutely. We're doing a, a really cool activation at Fountain Blue. It's our first one on this Friday on the 6th. You're going to be cool. there. I'll be there. You'll get to enjoy it. If you're in town, please come by. We're going to be tasting all this stuff for everybody. They're going to be able to come in and, t- and try it. Um, and I've got the whole team coming in and um, just a really cohesive sort of synergy between both of these organizations. And I love that this is, I don't want to call it Dana's new baby because he did a phenomenal job with UFC. That'll always be you know, his staple, but in business, this is something he and the Fertitas on on their own, and they are seeing now that they created a monster. Right. And I think they're gonna run it. Yeah, it's gonna run. No, I agree. And the fact that you're not a part to mention of... these fucking athletes are the fucking yeah. toughest guys. Yeah, I yeah y'all can't see it, but we got an we audience. Can't see it. We got a whole audience yeah. here. <laughs> That's it. Who doesn't let my deals is old team over here? Goes, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> you give me enough tequila, we can hit one right here, I'll be honest. Oh, I'm kidding. I wouldn't do that to you. <laughs> Without the cameraman. No, I, I, there's no way I would make weights. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> right. <laughs> well dude. Thank you so much for coming by. I appreciate it, Like, man. that is it. That's crazy. It's funny because looking back, it's always so fast. Yeah. But you got to hear how the it does take some steps. No, 100%. I mean, no shit. I'll say this right now on this podcast. I mean, in January of this year, I was I was self-distributing this out the back of my S class. <laughs> so, love that, dude. I love are, that. Bro. Hey, I love that guys like you are bringing, you know, a lot, a lot of these really talented strikers, giving them some, you know, giving them some, uh, some air time, telling their stories. And, and realizing that, you know what, like there's dreams of working your ass off and like actually getting to that finish line, but not without, not without trials and tribulations and not without a shit ton of resolve. And there are moments for sure during this entire exercise where you wanted to just go like, this is, is, is this going to fuck this fuck up? This is not going to fucking work. What yeah. are you doing? And you just say really, really, you know, diligent in that. And um, it comes, it'll pay off. Uh, yeah, so, 100%. Uh, we, no so a lot of these guys can re- resonate with that, and that's our point. That's what's great with our brands. We resonate with everybody. Yeah, I do. I love cool. it. Everybody. Boom. Try Go some deals as well. I'm telling you right now, it will change the way you enjoy tequila forever. And I am sorry, not sorry, that I will ruin everything else you've ever thought you liked. <laughs> <laughs> that was good, man. Thank, Thank you so you. much, brother. Appreciate it. Thank you.